Hey everybody, so McDonald's decided to create a, I don't know if that's a ripoff of the Chick-fil-A sandwich, but there's been leaked images that show McDonald's plan to win the 2021 Chicken Sandwich Wars. So, so McDonald's has your typical burgers, fries, fare, as everybody knows. I'm sure everyone's been there at some point. I know my family, uh, part of my family from South America really likes it. I'm kind of done with McDonald's because it's just been there and it's on every corner, seriously, like in my neighborhood. And when you're on the road, every exit has a McDonald's. It's, it's really unfair, you know, especially if you want something a little different. But anyway, they are updating their sandwich and they're taking a clear aim at Chick-fil-A in the 2021 Chicken Sandwich Wars, an internal memo viewed by Business Insider shows. So it appears that McDonald's is set to launch three chicken sandwiches made with new, thicker, and juicier chicken fillets on February 24th. So it is now January 4th. Got a couple, got about a month and a half until this unveils. If you, and the joke being with the thumbnail, you know, if you're a gamer, you want quick eats, uh, especially if you're playing a fun game. Not necessarily. I mean, a lot of people like to eat healthy. I couldn't do that every day. I would get sick. Um, and since we're on the subject of fast food, McDonald's ain't ever going to beat Chick-fil-A with their salads. I'm sorry. But maybe the sandwich is, is good. Um, I bet it's going to be cheaper than the Chick-fil-A sandwich by a significant amount. It looks like the new crispy chicken sandwich from McDonald's will feature chicken and criddle, or crinkle, sorry, crinkle cut pickles served on a buttered potato bun. I bet it'll be cheaper but not as good as Chick-fil-A. Um, and they're also releasing a spicy crispy sandwich. So McDonald's does this sometimes. As anyone remembers the Szechuan sauce that Rick and Morty made kind of famous again, they had that in the late 90s after Mulan was released, uh, the film, the Disney animation film. And people loved it. A lot of people didn't really care. I didn't really care, but a lot of people apparently came out of the woodwork and said it was delicious, and then McDonald's got rid of it, and it's only in our, our memories. But they do this from time to time. They come out with new uh, menu items, and then those that actually like it, they uh, they get rid of it. I, I remember a year or two ago, they had some sandwich with guacamole, and uh, I could tolerate it. So whenever I go back to McDonald's with family, I'll try to look for the sandwich and it's not on there. So I noticed that about six months ago. So anyway, these are some pictures of uh, <laughs> Chick-fil-A. You know, you can't beat their sandwich. We got pretty good breakfast options as well. Um, and I've got a Chick-fil-A right down the street from my house. So I'm probably no different than most people in North America. The sandwich that I cannot stand personally is the Popeye's chicken sandwich. So they're getting into the chicken sandwich craze, but I don't think they directly were competing with anybody in particular. It's kind of like a Chick-fil-A sandwich on steroids. I actually got physically ill when I ate one. I was at work and I bought the sandwich, no drink, no fries, uh, because the sandwich is actually pretty big. And this thing is loaded with mayo. Um, it literally was like dripping all over the place. It's it's completely saturated in grease, the sandwich. So the, the bread, this is what mine looked like. So you know the ads are like, here's an ad. The ad is actually pretty well held together, I guess. But when I got the sandwich, it looked like this, and it was just like cardboard. You had to eat it within two minutes of it coming off the, the grill, or it would just be gross. So I got sick. I felt like I was going to throw up. And <laughs> now, I don't feel that way when I eat Chick-fil-A, and the McDonald's is kind of palatable at this point, but um, it's just funny that you know McDonald's is doing this because I don't think they're going to beat Chick-fil-A I think they're going to beat them in price, um, which people, you know, people are cheap. They're going to buy cheaper. But Chick-fil-A has the uh, peanut uh, oil that they use, which actually is really good for people with allergies. And if not a peanut allergy, obviously, but um, it's, it's pretty good. I don't usually get the fries with the Chick-fil-A. But anyway, going back to McDonald's doing this, um, will I get one? Maybe. Will Mike Matei get one? Probably. <laughs> I know he likes McDonald's, so he's probably going to get one. Uh, but anyway, 
thanks for watching. Feel free to like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to come out with some new content. So I don't know if I'm necessarily going to invest a lot in, in food-related videos, but I just had to do a video about this when I saw the, uh, the news. But anyway, take care. Hope everybody had a great holiday and happy 2021.